Artificial intelligence AI has been on the upsurge for quite a while now in other parts of the world. No doubt Nigeria would not want to be left behind as such a development could result in ease of life in many areas and aspects from top to bottom. An event tagged Adapting AI for Nigeria, Crafting Intelligent Solutions for Our Unique Landscape has created an opportunity for tech enthusiasts, entrepreneurs, students and investors, among others, to have better insight into how Nigeria could be ushered into an era of prosperity by using AI. Our correspondent Abdul Salam Joki Lassisi has more. Keen-eyed and curious Nigerians are seated in this hall. They are seeking more knowledge about artificial intelligence at the Artificial Intelligence in Nigeria AIIN conference. The event hosts all-round interested Nigerians, indicative of the rise in the need for all to know more about AI and what it holds for the future. Many institutions and establishments in Nigeria have at some point navigated the waters of the AI sector. One of the sponsors is the Wigwe University, founded by the late Dr. Herbert Wigwe. A speech is dedicated to the late business mogul. In the words of Tonkin Wilder, an American novelist who once said, the highest tribute to the dead is not grief, but gratitude. With grief, you are left with no choice. You are held in its grip, whether you let yourself go or not, it's there. In many ways, it would always be there. But with gratitude, it's a choice I have made. Grief is, an, is, an, is inevitable. Gratitude is a choice. It's a decision I've made. Speakers, including the founder of Intelligence, Dr. Phil Ogun, hints on how AI can be effectively integrated into Nigeria. He speaks alongside others. But well, the plan for us, and what we're currently doing, is to apply all of this in AI robotics, software engineering. Uh, but we're going to focus about the fact that AI can help transform businesses. Uh, it can help in terms of making decisions faster for customers. Um, it can also help improve customer experience and customer journey, basically. Meanwhile, Dr. Phil Ogun shares his thoughts on how Nigerians could become more accepting of AI. It's for us to know that there is no stopping AI. A lot of people have been talking about oh, how AI could cause harm, and that's very true. A lot of people are talking about bias in AI, in AI. that's very true. But these are the challenges that you have when you have a new technology, okay? But with time, all of these things will, will go away. Just as participants speak on how impactful the event has been. People have really been wondering, they are scared that oh, is AI is going to take their job. No, quite all right. But if you don't upgrade yourself and get in tune with what AI is the next level, then those that know AI, that can upgrade AI, will take your job. Africa being that um, environment where the young people want to thrive in the AI space, having such opportunities and hearing from such people with such amount of wealth of knowledge is quite um, inspiring. The organizers say Nigeria cannot be left behind, hence the importance of the event, which seeks to usher in both the country and its citizens into an age where humanity and AI work together to achieve success across all sectors. Abdul Salam Jukila Sisi, Plus TV News. Hello, hope you enjoyed the news. Please do subscribe to our YouTube channel and don't forget to hit the notification button so you get notified about fresh news updates.